Hi guys, uh, welcome back to the channel, Supreme Media. Um, again, another feature. Um, this time a Championship White Edition FN2. Obviously the Mugen kit on the back. Um, this, that, now this is a friend, friend of mine through work. Um, I know it, I see the car daily, to be honest with you, because I, I go to the place where he works from. Um, his name's Jeff. Um, there's a couple things about, about the car. He actually bought this car from Scotland, I think, uh, and didn't even see it. He got it delivered and it turned off flat, you know. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a quick walk around the car with Jeff. Uh, Jeff will explain and then we'll probably just head out for a quick 10 minute blast or whatever and then see how things go. Also guys, um, today we have actually set up an Instagram account. Um, Jeff's just moving the car for some more photos. Um, yeah, uh, the Instagram is supreme underscore media YT as in YouTube. Um, and it was the only username I could get for Instagram. But all photos or the majority of photos we've done through the video. So obviously mo every car what gets, that gets featured, the photos will be uploaded onto the Instagram probably the same day as the video gets launched onto youtube and um, so like i say the link will be in the description uh please give me give it a follow uh and any cars you like the owners will be tagged so please give them a follow <laughs> Right guys, uh, round the car now. Jeff stood with me right now. Um, we're going to go a quick walk around the car and obviously discuss what, what mods it's got on it now and what mods Jeff plans on doing to the car. Uh, I, but yeah, we'll, uh, we'll have a quick wander around the car. All right, Jeff. Say hello to everyone. All right, how's it going, guys? Uh, so, I'm Jeff. And this is my uh, Civic Tire 4 FN2 2009 edition Championship White. So as you can see, I've I've done a few things on the car at the moment. You know, I've put the, the front splitter on, the side skate splitters as well, Mugen sunstrip, a couple of pinstripes, black the fog lights, stuff like that. It doesn't actually come with the uh, Mugen wing on there or the Mugen rear bumper, which Adam will get round yeah, we'll in a around. second. Um, so these were actually on the car when, when I bought it. And if I'm honest with you, I... Uh, I bought the car from Scotland. I never even seen the car. I took a risk. I saved up for two years. It was for get this exact car. Well, no, not not even this exact car. To be fair, I was gonna have a JDM EP3, but yeah, what, the Champ White. Yeah, yeah, the Champ yeah. White. Yeah, but what put me off it was that it had a limiter. I test drove a couple of EP3s, and I wasn't much for the gear stick, unfortunately. So I wanted something that. I could basically use on the daily because I do I drive this work and back every single day I use it for what it's built for <laughs> to be honest with you yeah yeah so future plans for it really I mean the next thing is wheels and coilovers without a doubt but I didn't know whether to go for springs because it's just a lot more convenient and cheaper but the thing is with springs, if I buy springs, I drop it on the springs, I don't like the height. Yeah, you can't adjust it. I can't it. adjust it, yeah, exactly. So. so they're basically the next two things that I will be looking for guests. So if anyone's got any wheels, hit me up, I do, I am interested. Um, if, you, if you do want to get in touch with Jeff, actually, because he doesn't, doesn't do much on social media, yeah. contact me <laughs> on, on YouTube, Instagram, whatever, contact me and I'll I'll hit Jeff straight up with what, whatever you've got mm -hmm. uh, in any parts, because like I say, he is after a set of coilovers, a set of wheels, yeah. all, all lowering springs, it all, it all depends on obviously what comes mm -hmm. up for, for Alfie. So basically what how it was is, I saw this car and the, it was up for eight grand at the time and I wasn't really prepared to spend that amount of money so I, I, I tried to knock him down but he didn't really want to, he didn't really want to budge so yeah. I just took a risk basically and um, I just said to him, do you know what? He sent me a load of pictures, a load of videos. I was chuffed with what he sent me. 
So I says, yeah, bring it down. All the way from Scotland in, oh, it was Kilmarnock, it yeah. was. So he bought it down, I paid the deposit, and to be honest, when it turned up, I, I wasn't happy with it. I really wasn't, you know, there was, there was a lot of niggly bits on it. I mean, he didn't tell me about the calipers. I mean, the left caliper, it wasn't even the original one. It wasn't the original caliper that came with the car, like as the Type R uh, logo and whatnot. And then um, the drop links went on it, um, which Luke Beard actually sorted out for me, so thank yeah, you for that. Yeah, Beard VTech on YouTube yeah. as usual. And um, the wheels were all scuffed, curved, everything. So I did manage to get it for seven and a half. I knocked him down when he turned up, so I paid £500 less. Um, it came with a custom single exit, which is just nice. I didn't want it, I didn't want it too loud for the simple fact of I drive it every day. And I don't want it droning my ears out, and there's nothing worse than having a loud yeah, car. My echo too is like exactly. very, very droning. Espe especially when you've got to drive work at half past five in the morning, and I live on a residential area, and I don't think my neighbours would appreciate it either, to be Mine honest didn't with you. Either. <laughs> <laughs> they never do, no. But yeah, that's, that's basically about it for now. You know, I'll be looking for other stuff in the future. I would absolutely love in a couple of years to turbo it, maybe. Yeah, I'd, I'd love that, but money <laughs> yeah, yeah basically i want to get the car looking the way that i want it before i i mean before i do any of that kind of stuff i mean a lot of people they go for like the maxed and the maxed in kit and stuff like that but i feel like everybody's done that so i want to go a bit different so i literally spent 65 quid on some ebay split i mean ebay front splitter and an ebay side splitter as well and i just sent it with that but to be honest with you in my opinion it's not everyone's cup of tea but I'll it does like the it. job and obviously you like yeah, it so that's, that's the all... that's the main that's the main key yeah. building a car isn't always about what other people think it's about what you think as the exactly, owner of yeah, the car exactly, yeah. and i'm assuming many people mm -hmm. many people agree with me on that yeah um sense. you know I, I i didn't buy that fk8 over there because like joe blogs over there said go and buy it <laughs> i brought it because yeah. it was better than me m3 simple as <laughs> yeah so um yeah so i think what we're going to do now guys actually is we might just jump in the car we'll just go for a quick spin around the block and whatever because apart from the exhaust it's actually standard wise engine wise yeah, it's, it's got a, it's got a k and yeah, panel filter and whatever oh, yeah, um, panel you know but yeah it, it's it might be nice to just drive just drive a standard tap or how they come out how they come out the factory you know uh, so yeah, I think we'll do that. If that yeah, awesome. yeah, of course, yeah. Cool. Let's go. <coughs> like I said, guys, uh, we're gonna go for just a quick run. Um, just see what, just see what the car's like first. Bit of V Tech goodness. Bit of V Tech, I got a bit of V Tech. Yeah, boy. Especially on a Sunday night. Got to be done, isn't it? Yeah, watch the pot all made for you, spotter. I know. just enough for me do you yeah. know what i mean it really is like especially if you're using it on a daily basis yeah. all's i need so, doing yeah, got the standard object in the mirror oh, dude, oh. oh that's got that's no, got object in the mirror yeah, all that's, losing. that's what's got me done on it <laughs> Yeah. Even though not many cars do actually lose to this, <laughs> from what he's been here. To most of it, the FN2, in my eyes, right, does get underrated. Because they always said that they're the worst type of I ever built, mate. This, that, a lot of people, they're not raw, are they? No, whereas the EP3 yeah. is really, really raw. Exactly. It, it wasn't what everyone was looking for yeah. when it came out. Um, genuinely, like. What I think what Honda were trying to do is they were trying to get obviously they still wanted the Vita, but they also wanted a family car. Exactly. Obviously, you can still get two kids in the back of yeah. that shopping in the well, back. Well, you can whatever, even well they come as a four door. Yeah. But you can actually I mean not a four door sorry a four seater but you can actually convert it so you can have the five as well. Yeah. You know what I mean you can just buy the, the middle yeah seat you like. can buy the kit like yeah and it will give it to you. You can have the five seats like yeah. Side, man. Like, I was just listening to the exhaust and whatever, mate. 
right, but yeah. Um, but what did it actually rev to? Top end, don't you? I'll be honest with you, mate. I, 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 I don't even know. <laughs> I think it's about. I think it's about eight. Something like that. I'm sure it is. Do you know what? I didn't. I got a bit all stretched out. Mate. Slow down. Just past eight, like yeah. eight two, yeah. yeah. So obviously that Davy's FM two, which obviously the, was the previous video to this. Um, he'd got the Marlin at ECU on it, so obviously he was revving to about eight seven. -ish, obviously through the ECU and obviously the standing mods he'd got on the car. Um, so yeah, it's it's a bit of a difference. Isn't it? It's five five hundred horsepower or so. Yeah, it's revs per minute. Yeah. Right? Not, but don't get me wrong, see, I'd, I'd absolutely, I'd love to have the ECU tech and everything. Yeah. You know, that lot. Like, isn't it somebody called there? I think it's Paul, Paul West, West, isn't it? Something Paul like West, TDI, and all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it, yeah. he doesn't actually own TDI anymore, he just maps there for him. Oh, does he? No, um, he used to own TDI, but then he's just, he's gone on his own mapping up and down the country. Own, yeah. I don't bloody blame him. From what, I've, from what I've seen, you know, he does good work, doesn't he? He's, uh, he's famous for the 247. That's what he's famous for, but yeah, that the, the ECU he's done on Davies. Davy brought an ECU from him, yeah, and the ECU plugged straight to the car, and that was it. Then the car was marked. And he's got like, you're joking? Didn't he on a dyno, oh, so it's literally just like plug and play, then, yeah, 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 yeah. But the, obviously, he, he brought the ECU. Um, Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's good. It's, 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 I could feel yeah. it like every time I'm pressing my clutch in. Uh, this is a good job when we got that run when we did as well because that fucking copper there. Yeah. He went that way, didn't he? Yeah. So, guys, like I said, um, we're going to end the video right now. Um, please like, subscribe, and share the video. I'll share. I'll send the video over to Jeff. So, show your um, support, right guys. Email. Yes, <laughs> definitely, please. It's, the channel's growing. Um, I've been two weeks now, I think, since I, I, I did my first video, and I've got uh, my subscribers are coming in daily now. Um, like I say, the more people share and like the video for me, please and subscribe, the better, please. Um, like I said on some previous videos, there's going to be more content Honda-wise. Um, like I said, I'm not going to go into detail on what I've got coming. So subscribe and you'll find out. Cheers guys. See you guys. Close the bedroom. I can't wait for this one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so Jeff asked to actually come out of this. Yeah, we'll turn that off. <laughs> um he asked to come out of this. Never been in one, so this is straight, this is raw now. <laughs> That's as fast as it goes. You <laughs> get it off. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, <fuck>. Wait. <laughs>
bro, I'm finished some calls. I swear to God, bro, that is quick.